my god bishop this is a lot this is a lot of information it is um, a lot of good great information like i said my spirit is just stirred up because i'm truly ready to go to that next place in god yes. I'm truly ready. Bishop, do you have a word to just, you know, in these last few minutes that we have, is there a word for somebody that just, you know, may uh, have been just surfing the, the channel, surfing the TV, and then they stop. They saw us, and they stopped because God had them to stop because there's a word directed for them. Can you just minister? Yes, and, and, and not only is, is it just specifically for one person, mm -hmm. but I see several individuals that being affected by it. And because when I say several people being affected by uh, 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 demonic spirits operate uh, in a group. In other words, it just doesn't come and attack one person. It uh, attacks several people. Mm -hmm. If you notice that if, if one person uh, has a headache, then several people in the, in the audience uh, uh, in, in, in the building will have a headache. Yes. If somebody is going through a certain kind of trial, mm -hmm. several people are going through it. Because mm -hmm. the demons begin to, they, they, they are better equipped than the church wow. is, they will unite oh. in order to get the victory. But I'm saying to that to, the, to that to that group of persons right now mm -hmm. that you're very oppressed because you can't seem to see your way out of the situation you're in. You're in. I'm telling you, I see a light before you. Jesus. And God is going to open your eyes and you're going to be able to see exactly where God is trying to take you. Yes. That's the dilemma you have. You don't know where you want to go. You don't know how to get there. But God is going to bring great clarity to you. And in, in just a few days, God is going to open it up for you. And you're going to be able to see yes. the route that he's chosen for you. And you're going to travel that path. And you're going to find great success down that path. My God. I believe that. I receive that bishop i received that for myself Hallelujah. Praise, praise <laughs> amen God. but Hallelujah. i know that somebody out there i know that there's somebody out there that's watching right now bishop brown just ministered to you prophetically and you know there's no way that he would have known what you were going through so you know this is an appointed time for you this is an anointed and appointed time for you and this is a time for you to connect with bishop brown Come out, you know, come to the class. Come out and join the ministry. You got the university ministries every uh, Sunday morning at 11 a.m. That's 2640 Old Bainbridge yes. Road, just before the ITN overpass. And Saturday morning when we're doing the prophetic class, it's not just for persons that feel that they are uh, that they are prophets, but it's mm -hmm. persons that want to learn how to hear God. Mm -hmm. There's no charge for it. There will be a free will offering received if yes. persons have it. But don't let that get in the way. Yes. If you feel like you need a word from the Lord and you feel like you need to develop your ministry, yes. we're going to be doing this every fourth Saturday of each month to the end of this year. Mm -hmm. But this, this coming Saturday at, at 9 a.m., we're going to be opening it up. We're going to be teaching on it. We're going to be doing some 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 line by line teaching, yes. precept upon precept, here a little, there a little, and we're going to open it up so that you can see clearly what God is saying yes. and what God is doing. Yes, in your life. and that's what we need. That's exactly what we need, Bishop. I know in my own personal life, you know, when I get clarity about something, when I know that I've heard God, I can be at peace. Yes. It brings when you can hear the voice of God, whether He tell you what you want to hear or what you don't want to hear yes. it always brings a peace because you know you know if you want to truly be obedient to God yes. you know that that's God speaking I got a peace about it in my heart and you know what I'm gonna I, I'm gonna trust God to handle this situation yes. so I don't know who wouldn't want to be um, in this class yes. in this class to really really it's about a, a closer relationship with yes, God God is. is calling us to come back to him to be you know one with him again yes. because the one thing that I can say um, that uh, over the years over the years ministry has become uh, a lot more than a lot of us can handle yes. <laughs> because it looks glamorous and a lot of people use it to their advantage but there are some people who really really love God, who want to see God's people free, want to see them prospering in their finances, in their health, you know, in their family, in their faith. And I believe that this is why God has placed this on your heart. Yes. Because now people have wanted to get to the top so quick. Yes. And because it didn't work out the way that they expected, some people have really got offended at God. Mm -hmm. 
But you got to know that God has not left you. God is calling us back to him. Yes. And the closer we get to him, the more he can reveal things to us. You just talked about that. And, and, they're, they're, and I, I sense in my spirit right now that there's some persons that are listening that have left the church mm. because the church has failed them wow. and have not have given them the room Jesus, or the space Jesus. to do what God had called them mm -hmm, to do. Mm -hmm. But God is calling you home now. Ooh. He said, now's the place. I'm setting a foundation for you to yes. grow from and to establish yourself and to do what I call you to do. Yes. yes. Anybody, if you're a minister that has, has left the church, if you are just a lay member that just doesn't have that confidence in church anymore, you got to know that you gotta, you gotta have this teaching. You gotta stay connected, and God is calling you back to Him. It's not about the pastor, the bishop, the preachers, or the members. It's about you and your personal relationship with God, and that is what Bishop Brown is doing. He's really, he's he's being a father figure. That's yes, the way yes, I see yes, you, yes. where you just saying, children. Come in, come home. Let me help you get to where you want to be, where God has already ordained you to be. Yes. But you just lost focus and got off track a little bit. And I really, I truly believe that these classes every fourth Saturday of the month at University Ministries will is going to help you and going to help a whole lot of other people yes. who have really yearning to hear the voice of God in this season. Yes. And, and, and the scripture says that he was going to turn the hearts of the father to the son, the mm, hearts of the son yes. to the father. And yes. more and more, there's a burden on men mm -hmm. to bring people up. Not yes. so much to do things myself, right. but to prepare the next generation mm -hmm. to take over and to carry on and expand the kingdom. Yes. The Bible says the glory of the Lord should cover the earth as the waters cover the seas. What is the glory of the, the glory of the God is what's in us. Yes. And as we move, we carry his glory with us. My God. So no matter where we are, God's glory is there. And when we know that, we can release his glory and bring the kingdom into every situation. Amen. Bishop, I thank you so much for, for joining me today. And I will be there on Saturday morning. Wonderful, wonderful. Um, ready to just sit and learn. You know, I'm in ministry doing, God has me doing great things. And I thank God for that. But I know that this is a season where I'm in a shift and God is having me to come so that I can get prepared a little bit more for where I'm going. Yes. You know, I, I got to tap into now faith. I can't keep riding off the faith that I've had, but this is a now faith move is yes. to come to this class every month and really sit at the feet of the man of God and um, get prepared yes. for yes. my future and where God is taking me and, and the ministry that he's entrusted me with. So I want to thank you again. This is a pleasure. This is an honor to have you here on the show. And I'm quite sure that all of the, our viewers just enjoy this word. You truly fed us today. Well, wonderful. Yes. Wonderful. So um, I'm excited about Saturday. Look, you guys need to come out. You need to connect. If you wanna, if you wanna connect with Bishop Brown, go to my website, nowismytime.org. Send me an email and we will get you connected. We will send you the information that you need to connect with Bishop Brown and we will be glad. We will love to see you on Saturday and on Sunday. God bless you and we will see you next week. Wow, I mean, you talk about being stirred up and excited about the Word of God for your life. I mean, hearing from God in real time, hearing God's voice in the now, that's what this prophetic class that's coming up at University Ministries this Saturday, August 17th at 9 a.m. is all about. Hearing the voice of God and growing in the prophetic at University Ministries International with Bishop Joseph Brown this Saturday and every fourth Saturday until the end of the year, August 17th, 9 a.m., 2640 Old Bainbridge Road in Tallahassee, Florida is where it's going to be located. You do not want to miss it. Hear God in the now. Yeah.
We'd like to give a quick shout out to some of our ongoing supporters like Marco's Pizza, two great locations in Tallahassee. And the pizza is absolutely awesome. Marco's Pizza has been a partner to Life in the Now TV since the very beginning. And our new partner, Private Gallery, responsible for all the host's clothing. Private Gallery, it's affordable, it's trendy, it's chic. Right in Tallahassee off Thomasville Road. We appreciate Private Gallery being a partner. Now let's check out some of the behind the scenes from Bishop Brown's interview. It was just really good. And don't forget, be there for the prophetic class this Saturday. It's going to be awesome. You, See you next time. There's some shifting going on, even with me. So what I really real appreciate stuff happens. It. I really appreciate it. God is truly doing some great things. Wonderful. I'm fired up. Ellen, let's do it. She done grabbed another camera. Yeah, look, this is behind the scenes. <laughs> 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 it was great. It just flowed. I'm what? telling you, and it was just so powerful. You can tell that fresh it's anointing and how it just, you know, it is just flowing. I'm, I'm excited. I'm, I'm truly excited about what people. God is doing right now. And I'm excited because Yo, I see the explosion mm. Check it out. out of the prophetic in this area. Yes. And I said to another prophet, uh, and, and you know what I'm talking mm -hmm. about, uh, I said, God is developing this area and this season as a hub for the prophetic. Uh -huh. And there are going to be those that are going to be coming from all over the world and all mm -hmm. over the other nations that's going to come here. Not just to the, to the what, 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 come to what has been developed yes. here. It won't be only at university, but it'll be at other ministries oh, as well. Yeah. Yes, and they're yes. gonna they're gonna pull in here, and a lot of the students are gonna be hungry for mm -hmm. what God is doing, yes. and they're gonna get it, and then they're gonna take it with them. Where yes, they go. that is so, so awesome. Is awesome. That, that's good. That is good. I look. I'm full right now. I feel like I've been to church. So Bishop has truly blessed me. That's a good thing. All right. Thumbs up, everybody. <laughs> the founders of America's three biggest pizza companies are named Tom, Frank, and John. But Marco's Pizza has a founder named Pasquale, who was actually born in Italy. Marcos, authentic Italian pizza. Oh, oh, all in together now. We can make it better now. Come on, can we do it? Yeah, you know that we can. We roll it up. Cause we know how to jump. We roll it out. Roll it out. We know how to skate. We'll cut it down. We'll cut it down. We know what to eat. We'll swap it out. We eat healthy stuff. Can we do it? Yeah, you know that we can. Can we do it? Yeah, you know that we can. Today's a good day to grab your kids and hang out with them for an hour. Dance, walk, play a sport, or cook a healthy meal. Because just moving a little and eating better every day can help make you and your child healthier. Can we do it? Yeah, you know that we can. We'll ball it up. Cause we know how to hoop. We'll mess around. Cause we know how to play. We'll drop it down. We'll drop it down. Cause we know how to dance. We'll veg it up. We'll veg it up. night and day. Can we do it? Yeah, you know that we can. All in together now. We can make it better now. Search We Can to find doable tips and activities that you can use every day to keep you and your kids healthy.